Hi guys, I'm Ali Akbar with Vibes. Today we are going to learn how to pass multiple value in Oracle Apex using parameters. Okay. Guys, if you not have subscribed to my channel, then please subscribe to my channel. Please follow SOP regarding COVID-19. Thank you. Today we are going to learn to pass multiple values parameter in Oracle Apex. In this tutorial, we would ex explore passing passing value with two type of items. First of all, first of all we will use with pop up type of item, and second we would use select item. In the short, we would attempt two example. In the start, I'm exploring exploring you that that type of example which we covered in this example in tutorial first of all i'm using pop-up in in front of your screen you can see first example I'm, I'm using account this is a parameter form and this is a submit button this is a detail report i'm passing you can see i am passing account I am passing a research. I am press button preview. You can see account, research, 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 and account. Two per two department showing on this report which we selected in our parameter values. So this example we attempt. Here using pop-up pop-up type of item. Okay, you can use multi parameters, MIS, or you can say any other account, AIT, LA, which you want. No, I'm showing you second type of item in which we use in this tutorial. Okay. In this front of you, this is a select list. You can say this is a select list. Okay. I am I am pressing king. I am pressing submit button. King data showing king employee. I'm, if I want to press an other uh, an other employee. Uh, and, and, and and other department number uh, and other employee number I press this control and press that scout part submit white which you want I press Ali press submit button because I'm selected three name you will you're showing that report showing that Ali Ali chance king which we selected in this chance king and Ali. so guys let's start so guys first off we start with example select list type this type i'm going to edit page i'm showing you what i would read good what i have to did just get type select edition type Assign query, assign parameter. So I'm creating new page. Select any. I'm signing any name. Okay. Next, what page has been created? No one is creating it. Origin, it vision, select an M, assign any name, no I'm signing type, I'm signing type classic report. Okay, I'm signing QD here, I'm just 
paste QT from here, copy copy paste okay and now I'm create page item create and selected column and just delete this type let me extra column okay save and play creating page item name and signing name copy just replace item name here e name okay now i'm going to this button like select list select list and um, press switch on setting multi allow multiple section on switch on and now i'm pressing now i'm assigning skill query are you from you sign from share component which you want select E name, E name, from M. Validate this query. Okay. Okay. Now I'm save. Now I'm creating preview button. Button. Assign name. Preview. 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 Okay. Button position. Um, edit. Okay. Save. Refresh this item page, which which you, which you want. Just simple basic setting. Success. Now press bye bye. System has been held. Okay. Now I'm press any from shift button. Clear. Out. Review. You can see clear. Scout King. This example. Attempt using select type. No. Uh, no. We discuss second type of. Pass parameter from query and uh, using pop up type. Okay, I'm creating page, creating page, creating blank page, pop up type parameter, press next. Assigning navigation, just finished. Okay, press next. Or blank page has been created. Now I'm say creating a region. Okay, I'm sending page a region name parameter. Parameter. Okay, now I'm assigning a page item. <sighs> Para. 
uh, I am signing debt number. Okay. Now I am showing you this type. No, this. Now I am changing type from stack take content to pop up. Pop up. Pop up. Pop up. Pop up. Yeah. No, that's a item type. Pop up. Okay. Static content. Pop up. Share component assigning list of value to depth. Okay, refresh. You can see different parameters showing here. Now I'm going here, just appearance changing appearance of item, item type. I am Page item type. Optional. You can see. Account. I'm just assign multiple values, switch on multiple value. This is a separator representing colon separator. And, um, before refresh, this accept only one item. When I'm reload, changing, signing multiple value. I refresh operation sales Ali. Refresh. Okay, now I'm creating sign different origin depth. Okay, signing depth grid. Assigning query. I'm just copy, copy. Guys, I'm just copy this query from here. Copy and paste here. This is a major. I'm using in string INSTR assigning page item name. Okay. This page item name. I'm just copy and paste. Replace that name. Okay. Okay. Save. Now I'm creating a button on parameter. Creating a button. Assign a name. Okay. I'm just changing position. Add it. Save and run this. You can see. I'm just hide this search button. Go and depart attribute. I'm sending IT account press preview button. You can say you can see account accounting IT and delete and assign 
ली रिव्यू आई टी बिकॉज अली है ली डिपार्टमेंट नॉन एंट्री एंड सेलेक्ट सेल्स प्लस रिव्यू यू कैन सी सेल सो गाइस और टू और टू टाइप page of atom example has been done successfully if you have any question please please uh, comment below the video or email me please visit my blog visit my facebook page thank you for watching i am alikbar thank you bye bye